Hi guys, welcome to Mask It by Katie. Thank you so much for watching. Today in this video, I'll be sharing with you guys a drugstore haul. These are a couple items that I got and I haven't done a haul in a while. Actually, um, a haul was the first video I ever made in YouTube. So I decided to throw it back and share what I got with you guys. And yeah, I don't want to make this video super extra mega long. So let's go ahead and jump right into the video. Real quick before we do that, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to turn on your post notifications on. That way you guys are notified every time that I upload a new video. And since you're already here, go ahead and hit that thumbs up. And by further ado, let's get started. Here it is. Oh, it's a thumbnail, girl. All right, so I got this box, and I got this from BH, but it's not only just BH stuff. I've actually been uh, buying stuff like always. I have shopping issues. Let me just clarify that. Um, so in the box, it came with this little cute card. I guess they're advertising the BH Galaxy. Um palette it's super cute super colorful love 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 and what else does this look like i don't know what this is so let's go ahead and start with the first item this is a brush set and it's a limited edition real techniques uh brush set and it's by sam and nick it looks like this um, my mom actually gave me this, so shout out to her. Um, she gave me these, and she also sells these earrings, which I'm wearing right now. So, if you guys are interested in purchasing any jewelry, uh, let me know, and that way you guys, we can get in touch or something, but yeah. Anyways, I'm getting sidetracked, so yeah. Um, so yeah, she gave me this brush set, and it comes with a contour brush, foundation brush, and what is this? It's a lip brush and also a dual, a dual ended expert uh, sponge. I've actually never seen this kind of sponge. It's actually the first time. So yeah, thank you so much, mom. Um, I love it and I can't wait to use it. Another thing that I got is this e.l.f. illuminating eye cream with cucumber and green tea. It looks like this. I personally have never seen this. Um, I'm very big in like eye creams because of my dark circles. So I feel like, and it was actually really inexpensive. I think it was like $8 or $9. Um, so really inexpensive for an eye cream. I hope that it works. And I guess let's go ahead and open it and see how it looks. Alright, so as soon as you open it, it comes with this little plastic thing, and then the product looks like this. It, it actually looks very high-end for $8. Not bad. Let's go ahead and open her up. It comes with a little plastic thing here, and this little thing, it smells very chemical. There's a little bit of a maybe green tea smell, but other than that, it smells chemical. <laughs> I don't know if that makes sense, but that's what I, one my nose thinks. But yeah, this is the eye cream. Um, let's move on. So from BH Cosmetics, I got the BH Liquid Foundation, Naturally Flawless Foundation, and it looks like this. Um, they actually sent me the wrong shade, so yeah, I don't think I'm going to be able to use this because this is very, very light and I'm, I'm brown. Yo, girl is brown. So yeah, this is, this is what it looks like. It's really cute. It comes in a bottle and I can't try it because it's the wrong shade. So yeah, I might, yeah, I might. Oh my god, that is not cool. Oh my god, I just got it all over my clothes. Ah! 
not cool BH Cosmetics. Very disappointing. Alright, so I am so confused because you guys saw it. I opened it and it was like a spatula. So I was like, okay, maybe it's like the Wet n Wild uh, foundation, which is this one here, the one that we're talking about. Um, this one has like a little spatula. There's no pump, but I went on Google and this is actually a pump, but I think it broke or something. I don't know. I'm just over this whole foundation thing to be honest. So let's move on. Um, I've got this. This is a lip smacker and it's Agua Fr Aguas Frescas flavor and it's strawberry orange. Um, I mean, look at the packaging. How could I not buy this? Look at it. It's so cute. Like, so freaking cute. Um, let's see how it looks. It smells so good. I can already smell it. How do you open this though? Oh, it is. I think, right? Okay, you, you twist it. And then it comes with a little applicator. You just... Oh my gosh, I can't wait to try this. This smells so good and it's so cute. Look at this. It's like a little... A little drink. Super cute. All right, let's move on. So I got this L'Oreal Paradise Enchanted and this is in Enchanted. <laughs> it looks like this. And let's go ahead and open her up. Let's see how it smells. some reason it kind of smells like tamarindo instead of peach. Do you guys know what tamarindo is? Kind of has like a peachy scent to it but I don't know it smells more like tamarindo for me but this is what it looks like. I am in love with this little palette. It's so cute. I bought it for $15 at HEB and it has some glittery shades and some matte shades. I can't wait to play with this and see how it goes. Oh, also real quick, I do want to mention that it has a li little bit of instructions here and it kind of tells you like um, where to apply it. So if you're like a, a newbie that's just starting to apply makeup, you can actually check it out on the back and it'll kind of instruct you of where to apply the shades. So I think it's pretty cool. All right, I got another foundation, and this is the Cover Girl. Oh. This is the Cover Girl Matte May True Blend Foundation, and this is in the shade shade Warm Honey, and this is what it looks like. Um, yeah. So this has the little pump. I already pumped it, so if you guys can see that it's dirty in there. I checked it out, and yeah, I can't wait to try this. I I hope that it's good. All right, moving on to another BH Cosmetics uh, product. This is the Wild and Radiant Baked Illuminating Bronzing Palette. It looks like this. And this one actually came free with my purchase, so I thought that was pretty cool. Um, I feel like these uh, illuminating bronzers are perfect for the summer because you do want a glowy, if you want, obviously, if you want a glowy skin, bronze and glowy, you can get that effect from this. Super cute. It comes with a mirror here and a little plasticky and this is what the shades look like I can't wait to play with these they look super awesome and super glittery so yeah it's another product that I got what else I have here all right I got this BH Cosmetics eye lights and is there a shade in here Oh yeah, this is in the shade Gal Pal, 
And it's just like an eye topper, um, kind of like the Stella eye toppers, kind of like the same thing, but obviously uh, not as expensive. Um, so yeah, this is what it looks like. A cute little bottle. It's gold and this shade is amazing. If you guys can see the way it reflects with the lights here, it's incredible. I'll go ahead and swatch this one for you guys. Um, since it's not an actual shadow. So, oh my god, I don't know how to do this. Okay, there it goes. I hope that you guys can see that. Super shiny, super reflective. And it's kind of like a gold, rosy... It's like iridescent at the same time. It's super awesome. I can't wait to try this. Alright, let's see what else I have here. I have this BH Studio Pro Contour Palette. And this is in powder. They do have a cream one. And this is what it looks like. It comes in a little plastic container. And you're just... Uh, you just press it here to open it and then once again it comes with a little plastic and voila this is what it looks like it kind of reminds me of the no, just, just forget. <laughs> but yeah I can't wait to try this out I hope that is good um, and hopefully it could be like a dupe to my Kat Von D shade and light palette because I absolutely love that one um, but it's, it is on the pricier side so this one could be a dupe for it is I think it was like twelve dollars eight dollars I'm not quite sure but nowhere near as the shade and light but yep this is another product that I got all right moving on I have another brush set and this is the rose romance 12 piece brush set um and this is what it looks like the little box and then once you open it It comes with this cute little bag so awesome so if you're traveling right now in the summer you can go ahead and use this for your brushes actually so it comes in handy and let's go ahead and I guess I'll just show you guys Two brushes because it's a lot <laughs> if not we're gonna be here all day mm, super soft it's super soft and fluffy I love their brushes they're super inexpensive and they're super good like they're such a good quality for the price you can't beat that so yeah this is what this one looks like this is the number one brush and what is this one for the number one brush is a powder brush so here in the back, it tells you what are the brushes for, so I think that's pretty cool. And let's go ahead and check this one out. This is more like a smaller brush, and it's uh, the brush number four, and number four is a tapered highlighting brush. Oh, awesome, I can see that. So yeah, and let's go ahead and do, I guess, one of the smaller ones. Let's do this one. Um, this is an eye brush, and this is a number six brush in the set. And it says here that number six is a blending brush, so super cute. I love it. It has the white and the rose gold. Love, love, love. All right, moving on. What else I have here? I have a, another eyeshadow palette. It's this one, and this is the, whoa, too chutty for this name, Neovu Neutrals. Ah, no, I don't know how to say this, I'm so sorry, guys. But yeah, this is what it looks like. It's, um, it's 26 shadows, and it's also a blush palette, so I thought it was really cool. I have seen it on the Instagram page, so I got a little carried away and got it. And this is what the palette looks like. It's white and it might get dirty quick because it is white and I'm not good with white. So let's go ahead. 
open it. I don't know why I'm having so much trouble opening this. Okay, there it goes. Okay, and then it comes with a little plastic again, and it comes... Oh, and, and actually this little plastic shows you like matte, shimmer, tells you right there. And this is what the actual palette looks like. Super cute, super summery. We have our orange tones, our pink tones, our more uh, purplish, violet shades. And then we have these awesome blush. If you guys have been watching my channel, I love blush. It's like... I would take blush over bronzer so I absolutely love the fact that the actual palette has blush and that it can combine the eyes with the blush so I think this is pretty cool and I think I got this for like either $12 or somewhere around that range I think it's pretty cool and I love the quality of the eyeshadows I feel like BH is such a good company when it comes to affordable products. If you are a newbie and you're trying to start maybe doing your makeup or if you're thinking about doing a, a, a YouTube channel, definitely check their items out. Um, I think they're, they're pretty awesome. One thing that I do want to say, and I feel like it kind of got me like a little, not frustrated, but I'm very impatient. Um... This company is from California and I am in Houston, Texas and it took them about 12 days for them to deliver the, the package and I was so anxious so it is going to take a little bit unless you're willing to pay the extra bucks for immediate delivery then you're going to kind of have to wait just like me. Um, I think that's the only downfall on, on BH, but other than that, I feel like it's such a great company and the fact that they sent me the wrong shade, I was like... But yeah, I love the company either way, so it doesn't even matter. I got another palette pretty similar to this one now that I'm looking at it, but this is kind of like the light version and this is the dark and you can tell by the actual palette itself. This one's white and this one's black, so yeah, and this is the blush neutral and same thing, it comes with 26 eyeshadows and the blush palette as well. Let's go ahead and open this one up. And this is what it looks like, the same, just black. And weird, this one doesn't have the whole um, shimmer matte thing, but it does come with a little plastic. And this is what it looks like from the inside. If it looks a little dusty, it's because I swatched a few of the shades when I received it. But yeah, this is what it looks like. Um, I think this one is more like a cool tone in a way, I feel like. Um... I don't know, I feel like I might use the other one more, but who knows. If not, I'll just give this to my mom or something. Um, but yeah, pretty cute. I like it. I love this shade. If, I think if I were to do a look with this uh, palette, I would probably dig onto this one. But who knows, depending on my mood, um, which changes 24-7. So. Alright, we're almost getting towards the end of the products, but let's go ahead and move on. Another item that I got was this Milani Baked Bronzer, and this is in the shade Soil? Soleil? Solo? Soleil? Shelly? Magnifique? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> this is what it looks like. I thought it was super cute, but now that I'm thinking about it, it kind of resembles this in a way, right? Let's go ahead and check it out and do a comparison. Why not? I don't know, I just like the packaging on this one though. Oh, cute. Oh, okay, I'll see you Milani. So it comes with a little brush, like this, super cute. I don't know if I'll be using this for that, but might use it for something else, you never know. Just gonna put it back in there and it does come with a mirror in here I'm gonna show you because you guys are gonna see that but it comes with a mirror and then the little space for that and then the actual product is on the top and this is what it looks like and in comparison to this one the BH cosmetic palette 
yeah, pretty similar. Actually, this one uh, seems a bit more glittery from this one. I don't know. What do you guys think? And this shade is different. There's no shade like this one in there. Um, so yeah, maybe I can do like a comparison or something. You guys let me know. Alright, what else do I have in here? Alright, I have this Maybelline Gigi Hadid. And this is a, a liquid strobe. Um, and it's in the shade Gold. This is what it looks like. And what is this? I don't even know what this is for. Let's see. Highlight to the fine your face with light. Gigi's application tip. Apply on... Apply on top of your foundation to create a natural contoured glow. Apply to cheekbones and on brow bones and then blend. So just an illuminator just as it says. So yeah, let's see. Let's see how it looks. Let's go ahead and I guess do it here. I don't know, I have too much glitter here. I'll do it on this one. Ooh, it's cute. Super gold. I hope that you guys can see that. Yeah. Okay, awesome. You can probably even use this to apply it on this area if you're wearing like a tube top like this one. And then that way your, your skin looks bronze and glowy. I would definitely do that. And if you... Here in my finger, it looks super shimmery. I think it's going to be such a good product. It just reflects with the light. I think it's super cute. Alright, let's move on. I have two lip products. And this is the lip gloss. And this is by Ray Ray. Oh, no. It's my Ray Ray and BH Cosmetic. I'm guessing this is like a collaboration. I don't know. I'm not quite sure. I think it is. Um, and yeah, this is what it looks like. It's cute. I love mobby pinky shades. Mmm, this smells so good. It smells like marshmallow. Mmm, I just wanna... Alright, let's go ahead and swatch it. Oh, I am going to love this shade. I can already tell. It's so pretty. What do you guys think? Cute. All right, and then let's move on to this one. This is the NYX Lingerie. Lingerie? Lingerie? Let's just skip that. This is the NYX um, Liquid Lip in Cabaret, Cabaret Show. And it's number 24. Let's go ahead and... Swatch it, shall we? This is more like a... I don't know, this one looks a little bit more darker than the other one. So let's go ahead and swatch it. Yeah, way darker. Okay. And this is what that one looks like. Ooh, cute too. Pretty similar, but not at the same time. Because this is a matte and that's a gloss, so... Yep, that's what that looks like. And this one has like a chemical smell. This doesn't really smell like something cute. Alright, let's move on. We're almost done, guys. I promise. Um, I got more brushes. If that wasn't enough brushes, I have more. Um, these are all eye brushes. They're all by BH Cosmetics. This was actually a set as well. Um, the reason why I have so many brushes is because when I make videos... For you guys or when I do my makeup on my personal time I don't like using uh, brushes that are dirty or at least I try not to and it's good to always have clean brushes and honey I have like a hundred brushes so I'm not going to be constantly washing them you know what I mean or is that just me I'm just lazy I, I don't know I rather have uh, new brushes I don't know uh, it's just okay just let's move on so I'm going to show you guys three brushes as well. This is brush number seven and it's a flat shader brush. Let's go ahead and check it out. Ooh, this is cute. I almost forgot how to, this looks like. This kind of gives me like a 
Sephora brush uh, vibe in a way. I'll show you guys. This is a Sephora brush and this is a foundation brush. It, brush. A foundation brush and they look pretty similar if you look at them. Pretty close. So yeah, super soft. Awesome. And let's see. I'll show you guys this one. This is the brush number five and this is pointed crease brush. I have a mess everywhere now and this is what this one looks like super cute this is so soft it's not it's not like a it's kind of like foamy in a way okay no that doesn't make sense it's super soft though <laughs> and yeah the brush is soft as well love all right and last one this is the brush number eight and this is a small pointed brush and open this one and this is what this one looks like cute and soft perfect alright and this is the last item guys and I got this kiss lash couture uh, glue for lashes and this is a super strong hold, remarkably gentle formula. So yeah, this is it. This is what it looks like. I've tried, I will look for it, but I have a missing here. I tried one that's similar, but it's not the Lash Couture. And I really like the other one, so I figured I would give this one a try. And yeah, this is my last item. Alright guys, so we come to a conclusion of this drugstore haul. I hope that you guys have enjoyed this video. And if you did, don't forget to hit that thumbs up. And really quick, I do want to mention that I added this new decoration to my wall. It says dream, obviously. Um, but I think it's super cute and I wanted to add it because I think that everything starts with a dream and it's a reminder to myself to always dream and always keep going and never to give up if you really have a dream and a goal that you want to accomplish never never give up so yeah real quick kind of random i did want to mention that but i hope like i said i hope that you guys have enjoyed this um video and i will see you guys on the next one